Hi there angels. I am going to be making a corn casserole. Um, this was on foodnetwork.com so I'll put a link below to where I found this. I just did a search for um, corn casserole and this is what pulled up. The ingredients involve a, a can of whole corner, kernel corn right here. A can of cream style corn, a box of Jiffy corn muffin mix, half a stick of butter melted, a cup of sour cream that I'm getting ready to measure out right now, and one to one and a half cups of cheese. I've already got the muffin mix in the pan right here. I'm just trying to break it up a little bit. And then uh, open these cans and get every the rest of it measured and measured mixed and then into the prepped casserole dish. The oven should be set to 350 degrees. So yeah, let's do this. Okay, I put it all in the pan or in a bowl and now I'm just mixing it together. Then we're going to pour it into the casserole dish. Bake it for 45 minutes. Remove top of cheese and then bake another 5 or 10. So yeah. Alright, I'll get it to go show you when it's in the casserole dish. Okay, it's in the casserole dish. It goes in like this, like I said, for 45 minutes. And uh, then it gets topped with the cup to a cup and a half of cheese. So be right back in 45. Okay, it's done. Looks pretty good to me. When the timer went off. I pulled it out and added the cheese to the top. So, yeah. I'm interested to see and, uh, how this turns out. Okay, I've got me a bowl full. I'm going to try it. Mmm. Hot. Hmm. It's interesting. It's of course cheesy. Um, corn forward. It almost has a polenta feel to it. I think I like it. Let's see what everyone else thinks. Right. Give it a try. Is it hot? Mm, not as hot as it when it first came out. It's, it's hot! <laughs> I ate like two, two bowls full. Oh, well, your mouth is like... Half <laughs> plastic, I know. <laughs> you eat hot shit all the time. <laughs> That's really good. But the flavor, I think, is nice and texture is nice. That's exactly what I like envisioned. What I yeah. I see this though as more of a side dish rather than a yeah. main dish. Yeah. Because it feels more like a side than a main. I would agree. Yeah. It's really good though. Yeah. But it'll be a really good side. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Agree. Pressure's on. Is it hot? You may want to blow on it. It may blow be hot. On it a little bit, baby. I, got this. I didn't think it was hot, but Chelsea said it's hot. <laughs> See, I, I would call it a cornbread casserole yeah, rather than a corn good. casserole because yeah. it tastes more just like cornbread. With like, mm. it's good, huh? With cheese. Oh my god. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it'll be a repeat for I sure because it's good. Yeah. Hey, this was Chelsea's inspiration. She's the one that mentioned corn and casserole, and she took yeah. us down this route. I'm here for that. <laughs> yeah. All right, Jay's ready to try it. Have you ever had anything like this before? Casserole made of corn and cornbread mix and stuff. No, okay. Mm -hmm. No, I haven't tried this before. No, I've never had anything like it. Yeah, I hadn't either. It reminds me of what polenta would be like, because polenta is is like a um, mashed potato almost, but instead of potatoes, it uses uh, cornmeal. So it has that kind of texture and that flavor of uh, cornbread, basically. Which reminds me of something I've had before. But it's good, don't you think? Mm 
sweet because the corn, but not overly sweet. And the cheese give it a, a nice, rich fattiness. Mm -hmm. So yeah, yeah. All right. All right, well, this has uh, been a very successful dinner. So this will be one that I'll make again in the future. But in the future, I will be showing you this as a side dish rather than as a main dish. Let me know if you've ever had anything like this in the past in the comment section below. And if you have not, did it look and sound like something that you would enjoy? Let me know down below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.